This video will show you how your students can select which group they want to be in in a course using the new Moodle 2 Group Choice module. You can download this as usual from the Modules and Plugins database on Moodle.org and once you've added it to your server in the mod folder, hopefully when you log into your site you should get the green success and the continue button. If we go into a course and select Add an Activity, we'll see now that not only do we have the regular choice module, but a newly named Group Choice option. Clicking on that will take us to the screen where we can select the set of groups that we want our students to choose from. So I'm going to have some animal named groups. Scrolling down in the miscellaneous settings, we can see that again, like with a regular choice, we can allow them to change their minds as to which group they want to be in or not and we can set a maximum number of students who can be in a particular group. So I'm going to choose from the drop down and I'm going to choose lions for the first group and I'm going to set a maximum number of 10. From the drop down again I'm going to choose tigers and set a limit on that. What is really important to realize is that you have to have made these groups, these empty groups, in the course administration beforehand before you can select them from the drop down in the group choice module. Other settings are as you wish. If we then scroll down to the bottom and save and return to course, what we can then do is take a look at it from the student point of view. So if we go in as our dedicated student Johnny Depp and he is going to choose a group in which he would like to be. So he clicks on animals and this brings up the choice of group names. He can see how many are already in the group and he picks the one he wants to be in and clicks save his choice. Going in as a teacher now, the regular view that we would see if we were looking at the results of a choice prove that it's worked, but what we absolutely have to do to check how cool this is, is to go in to the course administration and then click on users and groups, remember this is Moodle 2 here, and then that should show us that in the Tigers group that Johnny picked, he has been entered into that group in the course administration settings which he has so it's worked and finally another nice little touch if you are a student and you're trying to decide which group you want to be in if you click on the plus sign by group members this will let you see who is already in the groups so you can choose to be in a group with your friends or avoid a group with your enemies and that's it